Hey, Scory family. Today's mission is to unmask the Dr. Challenger. We don't know what happened, but in the last episode, Eden and the Dr. Challenger were both unconscious from some sort of like medical fog that was in the makeshift hospital, and they haven't woken up since. It's been about 48 hours at this point, and we cleaned it up, and they're both in here sleeping now at this point. Guys, I don't know what is going on. This is not the regular challenger who does all the videos with us. This is some doctor challenger. And again, Eden, like they're both in the bed unconscious. We're starting to get worried because it's been so long and neither of them have been awake for almost two full days, which means they haven't eaten. They've literally just been sleeping and we're starting to get worried because what happens if they get hungry or dehydrated at this point? What happens if they stay asleep forever? Look, look. Oh yeah. Oh, I thought you were showing up. No, she was just really ticklish on her feet, don't, but she's not don't, doing anything. Don't, don't bother eating. Maybe, Did she... it's, maybe it's like a coma where she can still feel everything and hear everything, but she just can't move. We don't know what it is because this is what was left over. So this was the only thing that we kept out and this is the interlock barrel of stuff that was connected to this. And that was the fog that started like spewing out when Eden and the Challenger doctor had their fight. So I don't know how we're supposed to wake them up. We've tried everything, loud noises, cold water, like nothing seems to break them out of it. We've done this like a million times, watch. Eden, Harry Styles is here, shirtless on a horse. Oh, and he's asking for you. Guys, nothing. nothing. Guys, whenever Eden takes a nap or something, she always tells us how even though she's sleeping, she can still hear what's going on in the real world. So maybe we should like try to talk to her and get her to... What's that? Oh, um, it's my reminder to eat food. <laughs> I get hungry. <laughs> Guys, we need Eden up before we can officially unmask the Dr. Challenger. Eden, if you can hear us, wake up! Uh oh. What? what? I just touched my eye after tickling Eden's foot. Am I gonna get pink eye? We have other medical issues to worry about here, Cole, besides your pink eye. The question is, what was in this stuff that put them to sleep so intently that- Wait! I didn't notice this before, but there's an ingredient on the bottom. <gasps> what does it say? It says sleep serum ingredients. I don't know what this says. It says Valerinacea. Valor Valerinacea? Guys, I've never heard of that before. Maybe we should look it up and see if we can find what exactly that is. And maybe there's some sort of antidote. None of us are scientists. I mean, Gabrielle had some STEM back. Huh? Okay, maybe we can Google it and see if we can figure out something. Because that way we can wake them up and unmask the challenger. Oh, no. Uh oh, oh. The, the, the monitor, the EKG does not look good. It looks like it's Eden. Oh, Eden. 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 Oh, Eden. Wait. Are you awake? Eden. Eden. Harry's here for you. Wake up. She's not waking up. Okay, let's go find what this ingredient is this so we can fix bad. this. This is bad. We're trying to figure out what this ingredient is that was in this like medical tube that, that they had in the makeshift hospital. It was called like the uh, Baron and- The Valerian Nisi. I'm trying to Google it, but hold on. I think I might have found something. I'm gonna be honest. I've seen worse ingredients in like Doritos though. Yeah, but Doritos don't make you fall asleep for two days. You never see me eat a Dorito. I don't know. Whoa, whoa, whoa guys. What? Hold on, wait, check this out. Hold on, I'm gonna put it on the TV. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay wait, 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 wait. Check this out. Okay, what is wait, it? Wait. wait. I searched this out, right? I guess it's like an ancient flower. Valeria Nicea root can be used as a powerful sedative to induce potent hypnotic like sleep. Okay, so that's obviously what happened. Sleep will become permanent if a total of 50 hours have passed and the victim is still unconscious. Oh no, okay. we're at 48 hours. Eden has been asleep for 48 hours. What do we do? 48 hours, that only leaves two hours left. So she's just like permanently? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Wait, keep reading, keep reading. It says, okay. It says to reverse the effect, freshly picked Valerianesia must be boiled with water until it turns blue and fed to the sleeper to pull them out of their slumber. We, okay, we, so, so we have to find the flower. Oh, so where do we get the Valerian AC? I don't know, it just says look for the flower with purple and yellow petals. And here's a picture of okay, it. Okay, so it looks like this. Okay, purple. It's like purple with a little bit of yellow on the inside. Right. But it just says it's popular in our across the United States, but it doesn't say where it is. Okay, how do we even know if we can get this in Arizona? Where are we supposed to find this? How, we only have two hours. We can't go to a different state if we need to. Uh, we'll fly. Well, we'll run really fast. I can run fast. No, no, no. Wait. Wait. User 13784 texted me. Wait, what? Uh, 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 it's just, it's, it's coordinate. Where? Why? Why would they just send us coordinates? I don't know. And then it just says, follow the magnifying glass. So maybe it's a clue. What does that mean? 
mean? I'm not sure, but I feel like we should go there and then check it out. Do you think that they could potentially know where this flower is? Or maybe they're trying to just drag us out to, to, the, to the 50 hours and keep eating asleep? Guys, but this user has been so helpful this entire time. It really does seem like they're trying to help us against interlock. Guys, so comment down below if you think we can trust them. Because if they're sending us these anonymous text messages, we don't even know if it's a real person. Yeah, but they did say they wanted to meet up, but obviously we can't meet up at Eden's unconscious. So I feel like... I don't know, we don't have another option. It said 50 hours, that's only two hours left. And we do have to make sure we unmask the Dr. Challenger, so I feel like we have to follow the coordinates and just hope for the best. Okay, what the heck? Let's, Let's just go, go there, there and see, it's not too far away. Okay, we have to hurry, we have to hurry. Okay. We're in the car now following the directions that user 17834 sent us, and I don't know where we are or where this Valerian AC flower is. I've never even been out this far before. It feels like it's definitely taking us towards the mountain. So hopefully we can find this flower, get back to Eden and the Challenger doctor. Hopefully they don't wake up while we're gone because I can't even imagine how confused Eden would be. Well, I don't think she will be able to wake up until we get it. It's not if they'll wake up in time, it's if they will stay asleep forever. Guys, we have to hurry and get there. We're at the spot that user said, but there's no magnifying glass. I assumed that there was gonna be a magnifying glass like waiting for us or something, or the path was gonna be called like magnifying glass path or something. Or there's gonna be a giant magnifying glass and it said clue here. I don't know what guys, what if this whole thing was just a wild goose chase? What if it wasn't even user 17834? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look, look, look. What? There's a magnifying glass right here. <gasps> Try this. Try what? Try this. Is it a button? Hold up, guys. <gasps> what is it? There's a note on the back. What does it say? It says, when faced with a difficult path, choose the right way to find your next task. The right way. Okay, so I guess maybe that means just go go until we the path turns right? Yeah, that's what I think. Maybe. Okay. Because look, at this is sort of a, we're in the middle of the desert, but there's definitely still a path here. And there's two paths. We can either right. go to the left. Or the right. right. So, so we go right. right. Choose I guess the we right, go right. right. Okay. Choose the right. Okay. Where do we find our next clue? I don't know. There's another sign. We could check to see if it's on that sign. Okay. But we're also, guys, keeping an eye out. We saw the picture of what the Valerian EC plant looked like. So I guess we should keep an eye out for it too. But we need clues to lead us to it. So we took the right path, but I just don't know if we went too far. I know, because it didn't give us a clue as to where the next clue would be. Um, why is there a photo of a snake? <gasps> okay, apparently we have to look out for a snake. These are not the shoes to get, get bit by a snake in. There has to be a clue or something around okay, here. Okay, everyone look around here okay, and see if there's anything oh, look that for they snakes. see. Uh, yeah, and watch out for snakes. Wait, guys, what's this? Oh, there's, there's an arrow. Arrow, it's arrow on the ground. The still. Okay, so maybe keep going down the path. Okay, let's keep going. There has to be another clue. Right. Just look out for another arrow, maybe. Yeah, okay. Guys, we need to make sure we can figure out where we're supposed to be going. We need to get back. It's already almost an hour since we passed it. We only have 50 hours, guys, and they've been out for 48. We need to get back. Any more arrows? Not that I see. Wait, look. Oh. It says, got it. the cactus with no arms holds your next clue. Cactus right. with no arms. Okay. Now we have to search through all the cacti in this mountain. That Wait, has arms. That has arms. This one has oh, arms. I have arms. Okay. Ow. That was sharp. Wait, that one. <gasps> You're right. That one doesn't have any arms. User 17834 definitely set up an entire scavenger hunt for us. And I feel like it's because he wants to make sure, or she, we don't know, but that we're actually dedicated to helping out and taking down Interlock 2. Right, because someone wouldn't be able to accidentally stumble across these and figure out what this is. They definitely were leading on this on purpose to test us and see how good we were. All right, okay, next there's one. the next one. Ooh, who wants to grab it? I'm scared. Oh, I don't want to poke That's me. The... I'm scared. Okay, okay. careful. <gasps> Okay, it says head towards the setting sun and you'll stumble across the next one. Setting okay. sun. Sun right. setting this way, so that means so go up the path. We need it to hurry. Guys, the sun is definitely setting. You can see the shadows, which means that it's getting later and later. We only had the 50 hours. I'm and so I feel like, wait, the setting sun. What do you do in the setting sun? You watch the sunset. So maybe on the bench? It must be in the bench. Did user 17834 set this all up for us? Right, it, like, did they. 
They said to meet them on the 13th floor, so are they here before the 13th floor or do they have other people working with them? I think this is just to get the Valerium Nisa serum so that we can save Eden and then figure out how to get to floor 13. Valerian Nisi. Valerian Nisi? It's very, I don't know why they named it that. We need to Valerian Nisa E, hurry this up. Okay, I'm leaving. You guys can continue without me. Let's check the bench. Is there anything here that could be helpful? Oh, yes. Okay, clue. There's another one. Hey, what does it say? Okay, it okay. says to find your next clue, start under a photo. Start under a photo, what does that mean? Take a trip three steps down, one to the left. Take another step up, and then your destination is two to the left. Wait, so does it want us to take a photo of us? I don't understand what that means. Wait, you have to start with a photo? So we have to take a photo. Oh, it doesn't say start with photo. It says... Oh, we'll start under a photo. Under a photo. So take a... Take a photo. And then put it... The, we go back and print the photo. We bring the photo back here. We, we're we not hold going it all up. the way back to print a photo. We were running out of time. Guys, Eden's going to forever be asleep if we don't figure this out. Wait. There are a bunch of photos here, so maybe it has to do with these ones? Uh, wait. I think you're right. Wait, is that start under a photo? Maybe it's it's telling us which of the flowers. Okay. Oh, good idea. Okay, maybe I follow this up. Put your put, put your finger over the photo. Okay. Okay, and then it says take three steps down. So one, two, three. Okay. One to the west, which is to the left. One to the west. Okay, take another step up. Up. Okay. And then your destination is two to the left. One. one. Two. <gasps> Wait, Wait, something moved. What was that? This opened up. Oh. Another clue. All right. Guys, I feel like we're getting close because that was definitely the hardest puzzle we've had so far. Maybe that was the last one. Okay. What's it say? Tick tock is the sound of the clock, so find what you seek upon some rocks. Rocks. What? So the flower's gonna be on some rocks? There's literally rocks literally everywhere. Everywhere. Okay. Oh, this is so bad. Guys, we're running out of time, so I feel like we should split up. We know what we're looking for at this point, so it's just a matter of trying to find it. It's led us to here, so it has to be around someplace. So I'm gonna double back, and then you guys keep checking down there, and then we'll meet back up if we find anything. Sounds okay. Good. I literally do not know what that even means. Are we supposed to look at every single rock? We have to, and we need to hurry. We're running out of time. Eden is going to fall asleep for forever if we don't. There's a rock. There's a rock. There's another rock. There's a big rock. Oh. What? Look, lots of rocks. Oh, oh, you're right. This is it. This is the Valerian ECE. It looks just like the photo. Oh, yeah. You're right, it looks just like the photo. It's it's purple with, with the little yellow inside. Okay, we need to take this back to Tyler so we can get back to Eden now. Okay, we have to go, go, go. Okay, guys, they said look for a rock. Um, I feel like, uh, oh no, it's the challenger again. Uh, uh, hello? <laughs> Tyler, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Have you given that offer any further thought? Yes, I did give it some thought oh, wait, and... Then make sure you do not unmask the doctor or reach 413 and we will have no problems. I'll be in touch <sighs> with you soon. Oh shoot, guys, I don't know what to do. $100,000 will definitely help us get a lot closer to the channel and... I mean, you can do a lot with $100,000. That's 10% of what we need. So I'm just freaking out. I know a lot of you guys commented not to take the deal and I didn't want to bring it up to Cole and Gabriella, so I haven't said anything, but uh, I don't know. We're just going to keep this a secret, okay? Just keep this our secret. Uh, I'm so stressed. Uh, we have to find Tyler. Oh, wow. Oh, oh, oh. There you are. Okay, wait. We got the flower. You did? Yeah. Wait. Okay, we need Actually? to go. Yes, we need to go now. Okay, let's go. But what, what happened to you? I. What do you mean? Where are you? I was trying to find the flower. Now that we have the flower, it's time to make the elixir. And all it said to do was to boil it in hot water, and then you should get a what, a bluish type color. That's what it said. I feel like that's kind of like magic. It's kind of okay. weird. Well, we need something to work. Okay, we cannot. Let, oh, it looks like they're starting to turn purple. Okay, wait. But we need to we need to cook it until it gets to a bluish color. Okay, it probably needs to boil because okay. like when when stuff gets to boiling point, like the important things happen. Guys, we are so close to the 50 hour mark. We cannot let Eden stay asleep for forever. And we have to have her awake so we can unmask the doctor. He's boiling, he's boiling. Wait. Get the thing, get the thing. Okay, we need to okay. put it in. Uh, uh, okay, careful. Did it turn blue? Yep. It turned really blue. Do you see that? Okay. So we can very carefully put it in this and that way we can like bring it to them and then see if it wakes them up. Hopefully it does. Hopefully we're not too late. Guys, I feel like we followed every single step possible. We've listened to all of user 17834's instructions. We followed everything. We found the flower. We did the research. Oh, this has to work. Tyler. What? 
We're pouring it. Careful, careful, it's hot. Ooh, yeah, it's really hot. Careful. Okay. This is it. Good? Okay. This is it. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, go, go. Let's go wake her up. Okay, we have it. Go, 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 go. Okay. So, what do we do? I'll just put a little drop in her mouth. Okay, okay. this works. Okay. Did it work? Is she waking up? Eden? Yeah. Wait. Wait, wait, actually, I think it is working, guys. Eden? Are you okay? That stuff's strong. Whoa! Guys? Wait, where am I? Wait, we're, we're in the studio. Do you know who you are? Eden, you've been asleep for the past 49 hours. It feels like it. Oh. No, it feels like I was knocked into another eternity. Okay, wait, take, take it what slow. day is that? Ah! Whoa, what is that? Wait, is what that is he doing here? More like, who is that? Okay, well, remember how you almost went into surgery and this was the doctor? Yeah, I do. He tried to perform some weird interlock surgery on me. Okay, but we had to wait until you were awake so that we could unmask him in case anything went wrong. But now that you're awake, I feel like we should try using the serum on him and wake him up. Wait, why does this mask say that? Say what? Like, I don't know. It looks like it's like a charger, like a low battery. Like it looks like when my iPhone dies. I didn't really think <gasps> did, about that. Did he die? I don't think so. Okay, let's just finally take off his mask. Okay, let's Guys, do it. Guys, this is the moment that we've been waiting for. I know it's not the actual challenger that we've dealt with in our videos, but at least we can start to see who's behind Interlock if we unmask the doctor challenger. Yeah, and we can finally figure out what these weird sidekick men are. Are they cyborgs? Are they human? What are they? What kind of fancy technology is this company using? Who are they? If you guys are new here, make sure to press that subscribe button and comment down below letting us know if you're a new subscriber so that we can find you and reply. And if you're an old subscriber, comment how long you've been a subscriber and we'll reply to you too. Okay guys, this is it. The moment of truth. Let's figure out who this challenger doctor is. In three, two, two one. Oh. Why won't it come off? It's stuck? It's a little oh. stuck to his face. Wait, why won't it come off? It must be a security feature. Maybe, maybe we have, maybe we do have to charge it so that way it can like, I don't know, connect to the system before we take it off. Right, right, like maybe like it's like going into like self lockdown mode. Right, that makes sense because the battery died. They probably have it set that way so if any of the interlock agents are out in the field and then the mask dies that nobody can take it off. Think about it. Remember when we saw the challenger in the blue room charging himself? <gasps> Look, the challenger's like charging or something. I've never seen his mask be different. You're right. They obviously have to make sure that they're filled up and because he's unconscious, he couldn't charge himself. He's out of fuel. Okay, we need to find a charger so we can charge him and take the mask off. Wait, we have charger cables in here. Should we check in here for a charger cable? Maybe? I guess. Okay, let's try. Okay, okay. so we have the charger, so let's plug this charge in. it in. I'll plug this into the wall. Okay. okay. It's plugged in. Okay. And, all right, let's plug it in. Uh, right. Three, two, one. Uh, Wait, is it working? Wait, it's working, it's working! Oh, wait, wait, I think it's working! Wait, what's there's happening? like, there's, there's like a, uh, um, I don't know what that means! Wait, what's going on? I feel like it's downloading something. Maybe? Or, or the battery's not good! I don't know, okay, what if I did something? Oh! Wait! Charging. It's charging. So it's working. That's okay. good! Okay, that's good, so, right? So, yeah. Uh, we just leave it until it's fully charged? I don't Probably. know, wait, we need to take the mask off! Or at least until it's charged enough that we can take the mask off. Wait, something feels weird. What's happening? Ow! The charger shocked me! What? Wait! Whoa! Where, where am I? Oh, he what? talks! What, what's going on? Wait, what's happening? This is not the Dr. Challenger! Wait a minute, wait a minute! Are, are you James P. Walton? Yeah, James Pennsylvania Walton, that's me. Pennsylvania? Who names are some pen after a it's terrible a middle, middle name? name. Thank you. What, what's going on? Who are you people? Um, we could be asking you the same thing. You're in our house. Wait, so are, are you with Interlock or no? It, interlock? Yeah? No, I'm not with Interlock. It, I, I used to have a channel. Uh, I, I gave doctor advice. And wait. The the mask. I, I have I have to go. Wait, wait, no 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 no! Don't let them leave. Don't let them leave. Wait wait. Did they make you sign the contract? Yeah, I I signed the contract and, and that's that's when it all started happening. They 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 hacked me. They got rid they got rid of everything. Oh, they got rid of everything. Does that mean they're trying to get rid of everything for us too? Okay, just take off your mask and then and then we can talk about it and then figure out how to stop this. Uh, not in front of the cameras. Not in front of the cameras. Okay, wait, 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 wait hold on. Now. Okay, we will all take your mask off. Okay. Uh, we just want to ask you a couple questions before we let you go. Questions? Like like what? Why were you working with Interlock then if you had a YouTube channel? Uh, 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 working for Interlock. The last thing I remember was I I lost three lives and then. <gasps> They made me wear this mask. The mask? So the, wait, the you were right. The, the people under the mask 
are actually people. It's just it's Interlock controlling them with the mask. Wait, these are all innocent people. Wait, so does that mean if we lose all of our lives, we become a challenger? The contract. The contract said after you lose three lives, they have full control over you and you're booted from the channel. That's what they meant. Oh, no, no. This is bad. This takes things to a whole nother level, you guys. We cannot lose any more lives and turn out like James P. Walton. Okay, but how do we know we can actually trust him? Like, how do we know this isn't a whole ploy from Interlock to pretend like he's normal, but he's actually still under the control? Well, I'm not trusting off. him yet until well, we see his face. Trust, trust, I'm not showing my face in front of the cameras. Okay, well, one thing's for sure is that the systems are still down, so at least Interlock doesn't have full control of us right now, but who knows how long we'll be able to continue uploading videos like this that they're not controlling. All right, fine. Uh, question then. Why did you have the badge for floor 13? Floor 13, I I will never go back to floor 13. But, but you, knows where it is. you know where it is. I, I can tell you how to get there, but you cannot take me back there. Okay. That's... What is floor 13? Well, if it's that bad, why does the user want us to meet them there? Wait, do you know anything about user 17834? No, but if, if they're on floor 13, you don't want to go there. <sighs> Well, I think I can speak for all of us when I say we don't trust anything you say until you take your mask off. Yeah, good okay. cop, bad cop. Okay, what about this? Let's make a deal. I'll go with him off camera, check under the mask, make sure that it's legit, as long as you promise to take us to floor 13 and then we'll let, let you go. go. Yeah, you can start back up your doctor TikTok YouTube page again and be free from Interlock. Interlock will never let me be free, or you if you get involved, but you have a deal. Okay, go Tyler, go. Okay. You know, uh, you know how I knew when I'm nervous? Yeah? I'm really nervous. I, I'm thinking I might upgrade it to a poot. Ew, whole lot no pooting. <gasps> okay, now that we know, you guys, that the challengers are actually people underneath them, that gives us a bit of an advantage because we now have a lot of information from James that we can take back, okay? For starters, we know that the, the masks can come off and that they have to be charged, but do we trust James, guys? Comment down below if you think that we should keep him like close by or we, we think he's no good. Well, I think it's important to note that after we lose our lights, we become challengers. So we have to make sure that does not happen. Yeah. Yeah, especially uh, I do not want to see Cole as a challenger. That's just freaky. I think, I don't know. I don't know if I can trust a man with the name Pennsylvania. Okay, I don't know. <gasps> Wait, Tyler? Right. What happened? He checked out. I mean, James is a normal stand-up guy. Okay, uh, James, uh, I guess now it's your end of the deal. I don't know, are you sure we shouldn't unmask him for the world to see? I mean, he was a challenger. Yeah, I mean. Listen, he has to protect his identity, and so we unmasked him, somebody saw what was under the mask, and a deal's a deal. He agreed to take us to floor 13, that's all that counts. I would say this seems fishy, but there's no fish in Philadelphia. Pennsylvania. It's just my middle name. Okay, I guess, James, lead the way. It's your turn to hold up your end of the deal. All right, if you wish. Uh, okay, all right, let's right. grab the keys and I'll let's go to floor 13. Wait, what is wait, this place? Wait, wait, where are you guys going? Floor 13. Is it like a place? A building? Their office building? Yep. Floor 13 is, it's in the studio. In the what? studio? What? There's only one floor in the studio. What do you mean? Yeah, the, the secret entrance. <gasps> Guys, I'm scared, okay? Floor 13 usually means something really bad and hotels deliberately don't put 13 on their floor because it always means something bad. 13, is that a good number? Buildings Wait. don't have a floor 13. Think about it. We've been hearing all of this weird construction noise happening lately. Throughout all the episodes, you can hear them and we specifically heard it last episode. So maybe they've been building floor 13. That's why the foundation of our studio has been cracking because they've been adding entire levels to it. All right, I, I said I'd show you where it is. It's your choice to venture further. Wait, why is he going towards the oven? It's right here. In the oven? No, <gasps> like in the, the walls? The Bruno episode, how we went in the walls? Guys, was there an elevator that we didn't notice? How? It led us to a dead end. Right, it's right through there. Okay. Go ahead. Guys, if you don't know, we've discovered that you can get to the back of the walls behind there. Oh, okay. In, in the Bruno episode, Eden and I were the first ones to go in here, but we didn't see an elevator. So what if this is a trap? Okay, Interlock has definitely been doing some sort of construction on the studio that we weren't aware of because they're definitely, we're not 
hidden entryways into our wall when we first got this oven from the baker. So I guess when Gabrielle and I were back there, the dead end wasn't actually a dead end. So I guess we're all gonna go in together now and figure out where this elevator is and what is on floor 13. Guys, comment down below what you think is on floor 13, okay? I have no idea, but I'm really scared to find out. <sighs> Guys, I'm gonna go in there too. I haven't been in the walls yet. I just saw it from the video. Oh, oh gosh. Oh, I really don't see how this is going to lead us Whoa. to an elevator. I haven't been back here yet. Oh yeah, this is your guys' first time. Just keep going, it's this way. Okay, come on. This is going to lead to the dead end. Guys, this is absolutely insane. All of this is behind the walls inside the studio and somehow this is connected to floor 13. Okay, so it's so tight with everyone back here. It was a lot easier when it was just me and Eden. Also, it's like a little more cleaned up back here. So obviously once Bruno went back to Cole, he like cleaned up back here because it was a lot dangerouser last time. Or was all of that inner lock and they were the ones who made it messy. True. Maybe they're still under construction. Okay, Maybe, but oh my gosh, was all that material construction material? because there were like wood beams and pieces of wall. Okay, but where do we go? We yeah. already know this is a With dead, a dead end. end. Yeah. This isn't a dead end. Why yes, it is. That yeah, last time we were here was literally a dead <gasps> end. Oh. Wait a minute. Where is this? Wait, this is just in the walls? Is this what we've been hearing all this time? Has Interlock been building a whole other room in our studio? A whole other room? <gasps> or like a whole <laughs> elevator? An elevator? There is one floor to our studio. They built an elevator to go to what floor? Guys, where did this elevator go oh, to? Okay, we have never in our life seen this before. <gasps> floor 13. Guys, this is how we get to floor 13. It's through this elevator. Yes, that makes sense. Obviously, this is what the user was talking about when, when they said floor 13. Guys, we finally did it. We figured out what it meant. We're going to floor 13. Oh, this is it. I'm sorry. Like I said, once you're within a lock, you're never free. Goodbye. What? What? Wait, oh, wait, no, no, no. what? What do you mean no, no. you're never free? Why does the door close? Why does the door close? Why is going to add? Why does that 